After recent wildfires in Sevier County, being prepared for the unexpected was the message many emergency responders and organizations wanted to get across yesterday. Six on your side reporter Veronica Obe was at the Wildfire Community Preparedness Expo and found out why many people in attendance felt like the event was so important. First responders and wildfire safety groups met at the fairgrounds in Sevierville to give people the tools to make their structures safer, you know, when a wildfire does occur. And those tools and information were provided to the Fire Community Preparedness Expo taking place after the recent Hatcher Mountain fires. But for Pete Euchre, the event serves as a way to educate the community in hopes of avoiding the devastating outcomes of the Gatlinburg fire. I got into Firewise because of that, and that's what spurred me on to do what we're doing. Euchre was one of the many who lost his home in 2016, so for him, this is a topic he's always willing to talk about to help save homes, but most importantly, lives. Make sure you realize that once a fire is in the air, it's too late to prepare. And he's hoping this message spreads to locals along with any visitors in the area. Here in Sevier County, we have a lot of tourists, a lot of guests that come to visit our place. Make sure that the places that they are renting have information in them on where they are and how to get out. This is amongst many other points the event aimed to push out to keep homes and people safe. Sevier County Fire Administrator David Puckett says there are many components to consider and it's better to be prepared sooner rather than later. Even if you don't think that you're, you know, um, a risk for a wildfire in your area, you know, it, there's, there's still a lot of measures you can take to help reduce that. Reporting in Sevierville, Veronica Obey, WATE 6 on your side. All right, good advice, Veronica. And if you want to read more of the information shared at that event, we have it all on our website, WATE.com.